Well, today was supposed to be the first day of class for Tiffin City Schools, but administrators decided to push back the date to later this week due to the high temps. Tatiana Cash went to talk to families to see how they felt about the decision. Students for Tiffin City Schools were supposed to start classes today. Unfortunately, the weather has caused plans to shift. WTO 11 meteorologists say Tuesday and Wednesday's heat index is over 100 degrees. So administrators renamed the district's first day of school Thursday. Mom of two Tiffin Public School students, Sarah Leonard, says she's okay waiting a few more days. I'd rather him be home and safe. She says she understands some posts on social media against the district's choice to cancel classes. Yeah, back in the day when we were in school, it, there was no air conditioning and stuff, but they, it does affect how kids learn, too. If they're hot and sweaty, they're not going to be learning anything today. Superintendent Jerry Nadeau says it just doesn't make sense to send kids to school for the sake of sending them to school in this oppressive heat, especially when data finds it to be a bad idea for the child's well-being. And it basically says for every one degree of Fahrenheit that goes into the excess heat, right, it affects our learning by 1%. Our test scores go down, our ability to stay on track, behaviors, mood, all increase. Nadeau says the temperatures outside are worse inside the classrooms since teachers cannot open classroom doors during school to assist with airflow. And with no AC, he doesn't see a good learning environment or a good way to start off the school year. Toughing it out sometimes making tough decisions and being able to bear the responsibility is modeling for our students. We have to do what we think is best given the information we have and protecting our students' well-being perhaps is more important than making them tough. It's all about making sure the students are able to learn properly in a safe, comfortable environment. Here in Tiffin, Tatiana Cash, WTOL 11. You know, if there's severe weather, if there are hot days, it's always a great chance and opportunity for us to tell you about the WTOL 11 weather app. It is a free download for Apple and Android devices. Our team of meteorologists sent out updates constantly and will alert you to any severe weather should it head your way.